like to think that there was some degree of discretion, you know, that I finally came to my senses, but that's not the case at all because what had happened was we got to school and they were asking us who had sold all of our first case and needed a second case. Who needs a second case of peanut M&Ms? And before I knew it, my hands shot up and before I knew it, for my sins, I was given a second case of peanut M&Ms. I was over leveraged, like way over leveraged with the peanut M&Ms. I couldn't make my margin calls anymore. I didn't have any more money. I just started scribbling on pieces of paper $1.50 and putting it in the box because I thought, well, if it's good for Wall Street, it's good enough for me. And then I figured it out. All I needed to do was completely strip away my moral and ethical programming to realize what I could do was to go into the classrooms after school during drama practice and sneak into the boxes of peanut M&Ms and just replenish my stash and steal them. And I do, I do it. I wish I could say I felt terrible about doing it, but instead all I felt was relief, like, oh, thank God I can do this. And so I stole and stole and stole and I had the solution and then I ate it.